What's up everybody? It's Dark Shack again. And yeah, this is XSplit in that infinite loop. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to show you how to remove the black bar from around your videos if you render it in Movie Maker. So you see I dragged in my video right here. This is a 720p video. And all you have to do is go to File, go to where it says Save Movie, you don't click it. And just go all the way down here, scroll down to the bottom, and it says Create Custom Setting. You click on that, you make sure this setting is new. It's not any of these presets, it's new. And you name it whatever, so let's say 720p HD, and make sure these numbers are correct. This is 1280, this is 720, this is 8000, and this is 29.97. I know the frame rate, the frame rate should be 29. 0.97 because that's like 30 frames per second and YouTube if you have like a 60 frame per second video YouTube will dial it down to this number anyway so you might as well be rendering in this uh, do that keep this audio format right here and then click save when you click save it, it'll save the movie maker video settings file so just save that wherever they tell you and then close and then to render your video just click file save movie and your 720p HD will be right there. Click it, name your movie, and then save it to wherever you want to save it. And you can save it as a MPG or a Windows Media file, but I do MPG, smaller file. And you click save, and then your video renders. And whenever your video is done rendering like that, just click play. This is the test, and on here it is. You know, no black Follow bars it. around it, and when you upload it to YouTube, it'll be exactly how ever you edit it. Render it. And okay, thanks for watching, and yeah, peace.